Hello, everyone. In arcane lineage, the diverse range of classes offers players unique opportunities to engage in turn-based combat and navigate through a world teeming with challenges and adversaries. With each class tailored to distinct playstyles, players must strategically choose their path to power and victory within the game's dynamic landscape. From mastering arcane arts to honing combat prowess, each class presents its own set of challenges and rewards, enticing players to explore the depths of their abilities and tactics. As players progress through arcane lineage, the allure of unlocking higher tier classes beckons, fueling their journey with aspirations of mastering new skills and unleashing untapped potential. With each class possessing its own level requirements for advancement, players are encouraged to chart their course carefully, balancing immediate needs with long-term goals to forge a path uniquely their own. Whether delving into the mysteries of magic or embracing the art of combat, the diverse array of classes in arcane lineage ensures that every player can find their niche and rise to prominence in the ever-evolving realm of adventure and conquest. I'm quickly moving on to the video and I'm ranking classes in arcane lineage. Before we start, if you enjoy these types of tier list videos, don't forget to like the video and subscribe. Enjoy watching. In the realm of arcane lineage within Roblox, the martial artist class emerges as a formidable specialization, honing in on sheer raw and percentage-based damage output. Its super derivations exceed expectations, ensuring dominance over other classes. To unlock its secrets, one must venture forth towards the Deep Roots Canopy Path, embarking from the bustling Caldera Town, only accessible to those who have attained level 5 proficiency or higher. As a result, I'm placing Martial Artist in the C tier. The Warrior class stands as a formidable force, specializing in the art of swordplay and inflicting physical damage upon adversaries. To master the intricacies of warrior skills, players must engage in quick-time events, deftly pinpointing rectangles within a blue section of the bar by tapping the space bar with precision and speed. Aspiring warriors seeking to harness this prowess can seek guidance from the warrior trainer stationed just beyond the gates of Caldera Town, their tutelage becoming accessible at level 5 and beyond. As a result, I'm placing warrior in the C tier. The Slayer class emerges as a formidable force, specializing in the deft manipulation of a spear with swift precision. Mastery of this class demands keen attention and agility, as players must engage in a minigame where they must click the left mouse button, LMB precisely when the circles flash solid blue before they vanish. Notably, failure to catch the last blue circle results in instant defeat, adding an element of urgency to each encounter. To embark on the journey of the Slayer, players must seek out Tivek, nestled within the cave near the Wizard Tower, with a requisite level of 5 or higher. As a result, I'm placing Slayer in the B tier. The Thief class emerges as a master of thievery, adept at inflicting diverse forms of damage upon adversaries. In this minigame ability, players must swiftly press the spacebar as the arrow aligns with the gap in a rotating circle, the velocity of which varies dynamically. Adventurers seeking to unlock the secrets of the thief can rendezvous with boots at one of the corners nestled within Caldera Town, provided they've attained a level of 5 or higher. As a result, I'm placing Thief in the B tier, the wizard class stands as a beacon of arcane mastery and wisdom. Channeling the essence of magic itself, wizards weave intricate spells that manipulate the very fabric of reality, focusing on a repertoire of status effects, empowering buffs, and devastating damage. Yet, mastering the wizard's craft demands dexterity and agility, as players engage in a complex minigame, deftly dragging runes to their designated spots amidst the frenetic pace of gameplay. To seek counsel from the venerable Arendor, one must ascend the invisible ladder to the pinnacle of the wizard's tower, a feat reserved for those of level 5 and beyond. As a result, I'm placing wizard in the C tier. The Blade Dancer emerges as a formidable neutral superclass branching from the warrior archetype. With a focus on both high damage output and resilient tanking capabilities, the Blade Dancer stands out with its distinctive parry ability offering players a strategic edge in combat. To unlock the secrets of this class, 
Adventurers must seek out the trainer stationed upon the wooden stairway, leading to Tundra, venturing left from the Wizard Tower and past the mines. However, only those who have attained level 15 or higher can beseech the trainer to impart their invaluable knowledge upon them. As a result, I'm placing Blade Dancer in the A tier. Rogue stands out as a versatile and neutral superclass stemming from the Thief lineage. Focused on inflicting damage over time and executing multi-hit attacks, the Rogue embodies agility and precision in combat. Positioned strategically within the Scorching Desert, adjacent to the Doctor and Paladin Trainer, the Rogue navigates the sands with finesse, leaving adversaries reeling from its relentless onslaught. As a result, I'm placing Rogue in the A tier. The Lancer class stands as a formidable evolution from the Slayer archetype within the realm of arcane lineage on Roblox. Accessible to those who have achieved a commendable level 15 or higher as a Slayer, the Lancer embodies the essence of a stalwart tank, adept at drawing the ire of adversaries away from vulnerable allies. To seek tutelage in this prestigious path, adventurers venture left from the Wizard Tower, navigating past the treacherous mines and ascending the wooden scaffolding beyond the Blade Dancer Mentor. There, atop stone stairs leading to the lair of great beasts, aspiring lancers find their mentor, ready to impart the wisdom necessary to command attention on the battlefield and safeguard their comrades with unwavering resolve. As a result, I'm placing Lancer in the S tier. Brawler stands out as a formidable choice among its diverse array of classes. Derived from the martial artist superclass, the Brawler specializes in dealing physical, multi-hit damage, making it an excellent option particularly suited for newcomers to the game. To seek tutelage in the art of the Brawler, adventurers are directed to journey towards the Tundra, where, upon passing a colossal boulder, they will discover the trainer perched upon a cliff, beckoning those of level 15 and above to hone their skills. As a result, I'm placing Brawler in the B tier. The Paladin class stands as a stalwart figure within the realm of Arcane Lineage, a prominent superclass stemming from the Sword Branch. Notably, it assumes the role of a Guardian, uniquely capable of absorbing damage to shield allies, a pivotal asset during prolonged encounters like the daunting Metrom's Vessel boss battle. Upon attaining the esteemed level of 15, players are prompted to seek out Obras in the Desert Village, stationed near the main edifice. It's imperative to adhere to an orderly alignment to engage in this encounter. Within the intricate tapestry of arcane lineage in Roblox, the Paladin emerges as a vital cornerstone, embodying resilience and protection amidst formidable trials. As a result, I'm placing Paladin in the A tier. Saint emerges as a transcendent upgrade within the Slayer class hierarchy. Positioned as the epitome of healing prowess, the Saint transcends conventional roles, blending the resilience of a tank with the nurturing essence of a healer. Renowned for their unparalleled ability to purge debuffs and administer substantial health rejuvenation, the Saint stands as the paragon for those who cherish the healer archetype in MORPGs. To embark on the path of the Saint, adventurers must venture into the desert, where a mentor awaits atop a colossal ribcage to bestow enlightenment. However, the pilgrimage demands a threshold of level 15 mastery and an unwavering commitment to orderly alignment, ensuring that only the most dedicated disciples ascend to embody the sanctified mantle. As a result, I'm placing Saint in the S tier. Monk class stands out as a formidable force, blending endurance with devastating punching power. To unlock this superclass, adventurers must first reach level 15, and seek out the monk trainer amidst the sprawling desert landscape, where he perches atop a rocky formation surrounded by the elusive Carnestool spawns. Masters of the monk class not only excel in sustaining themselves, but also engage in a unique minigame, honing their skills by following intricate arrow key patterns, a testament to their discipline and precision in combat. As a result, I'm placing monk in the S tier. The Elementalist stands as the epitome of the mage class in the arcane lineage game on Roblox, representing a refined and potent evolution. With its orderly superclass upgrade, it embodies the essence of standard magic while boasting remarkable adaptability and versatility in combat scenarios. Masters of Elemental Forces, 
elementalists wield devastating power to swiftly dismantle groups of adversaries, seamlessly transitioning between defense and offense with the fluidity of the elements themselves. In the throes of battle, they command the very forces of nature, unleashing torrents of fire, ice, lightning, and earth to shape the battlefield to their advantage. As a result, I'm placing Elementalist in the A tier. Berserker stands out as a formidable force among the array of classes available. Emerging as a chaotic alignment superclass derived from the warrior path, the Berserker epitomizes melee prowess, boasting formidable damage capabilities that make it a force to be reckoned with on the battlefield. As adventurers venture beyond level 15, a journey to the depths of Deep Root Canopy unveils a hidden sanctuary where the Berserker Master resides, tucked away within a dimly lit cavern accessible via a stone path veering right beyond the initial entrance. Navigating the darkness demands caution, yet the rewards of mastering the Berserker's ferocious combat style prove worth the perilous journey. As a result, I'm placing Berserker in the S-tier. The Assassin class in Arcane Lineage on Roblox is a chaotic upgrade from the Thief class, designed for players seeking high DPS potential, coupled with strategic invisibility and debilitating poison debuffs. Geared towards those who prefer avoiding damage while inflicting chaos upon their foes, the Assassin excels in stacking debuffs and delivering potent single-hit damage. With the ability to manipulate enemy aggro and troll friends with stealth mechanics, it offers a thrilling gameplay experience for those who revel in the art of calculated strikes and evasion. As a result, I'm placing Assassin in the A tier. Impaler emerges as a formidable force within the Slayer class, transcending into the chaotic prowess of the Super class. This audacious upgrade beckons to risk takers, adept dodgers, and even those with a masochistic streak. The Impaler, an embodiment of raw power and recklessness, is a DPS and glass cannon hybrid, unleashing devastating damage upon adversaries, but at the perilous cost of its own health. As players navigate the intricate landscapes of arcane lineage, choosing the Impaler class requires a delicate balance between aggression and survival, making it a daring choice for those who seek the thrill of high stakes and masterful evasion. As a result, I'm placing Impaler in the S tier. Dark Wraith stands as a formidable upgrade within the realm of arcane lineage on Roblox, transcending the conventional martial artist class with its chaotic prowess. A fusion of DPS mastery and summoning expertise, it beckons to those solitary souls and disillusioned wanderers seeking power. As wielders of the Chaotic Fist, Dark Wraiths command the summoning of a fearsome Dark Beast, a relentless entity that tears through adversaries with unmatched ferocity, ensuring their dominance on the battlefield. As a result, I'm placing Dark Wraith in the A tier. The Necromancer rises as the chaotic superclass upgrade within the Mage lineage in the realm of Arcane lineage in Roblox. This formidable entity emerges as a summoner and support specialist, wielding powers that draw upon the very essence of chaos. Masters of the Arcane Arts, Necromancers command an array of dark summons, their damage intricately woven with the strength of their spectral allies. Within battles, they stand as a formidable force, capable of dealing significant damage while simultaneously bolstering the ranks of their summoned companions, embodying the ultimate fusion of chaos and mastery over the arcane arts. As a result, I'm placing Necromancer in the S tier. The video concludes here. In your opinion, which is the best class in arcane lineage? Share your thoughts in the comments and let's discuss. See you in another video. Don't forget to subscribe.